Hey everyone! Today we are going to go through a tub of Pokemon collectibles from when I was a young child. A lot of the stuff I haven't seen in quite a while, so I thought it'd be fun if we got to go through it together, and maybe this might kind of spark some memories for you as well. So what we'll do is we'll get stuff out of this tub, get it on the table, and just kind of uh, go from there. So okay, first off we got uh, some dry erase boards, uh, kind of a plain Pokemon one on the right, and one with the original 150 on the left. That's pretty neat. We have one of these shiny Pokeballs. Unfortunately, if you remember these, they used to come with a gold bar in them um, that had a Pokemon on it. These are just some random little square cards. Still, still very cool. I don't know what these are from, though. I don't remember these little square cards from anything. So if anybody knows, let me know in the comments. Um, we have this, I kind of remember this, it is a little marble holder with a Raichu on it. Can you kind of see the marble inside there? Oh, boy, that's loud. Venusaur, Dratini, a couple others in here. Oh, a little crabby. Okay, that's neat. I don't really remember playing marbles, and I don't know what this thing is in the center, but that's cool. We'll set that over here. Ooh, okay. So this one, these are neat. I do not remember using them ever though. And it's maybe just kind of so young at the time. But Squirtle and Charmander little walkie talkies. I really like these. These are very cool. I just don't remember using them, which it's not a bad thing. I like having them. So for the sake of nostalgia, they still, uh, they still are a little bit of a throwback for me. Okay, let's keep going. I don't know what's in this paper towel. Oh, nothing, just paper towel, okay. We have some Ash and Brock little figurines. Looks like they move around. I'm gonna just leave them in the baggie though, if that's fine. Um, okay, we got some more little figurines, a whole bunch of them in there. So, some duplicate sand slashes, little Lapras down there. The Cubone, Blastoise. Okay, those are cool. I'll get those over there. A small tin. I actually really like this tin with the little flames on it and all the fire Pokemon. Oh, there's a little bit of rust, but it's not the end of the world. Uh, I can't get it open. There we go. Okay, so this is cool, guys. Some little keychains in here. I'm assuming you can take these little cutouts and put them in the keychains? Oh wait, these must, oh, these are from a cereal box. These are from some sort of cereal box I remember now. There must have been like Pokemon cereal. Okay, there has to have been it. I think I remember that too. And then these, can you put these? Oh wait, these might be something from a part of these games. Okay, well, we'll kind of see as we get further along what these might be from. Hopefully we'll find that out, put them next to the figurines. Got to catch more memory game. Let's see what's in here. Flip tokens. So there's little tokens in here, but uh, these are not the same tokens as the other ones. Okay, this looks very basic. I don't remember playing this. It's actually kind of a ironic concern to memory game, I suppose. But, oh, okay, what is this? Gotta catch them all. Adventure playset. Sticks like magic. Stick and lift. Are these like decals? Ugh. It's by Rose Art. Oh, okay. So it's some sort of arts and craft thing. Oh, wait a minute. Did I never even use these? Oh, wait. Is this it? Is this literally it? Is that literally it? That's, that's it for Pokemon? There's like one sheet? Hmm. Okay. Well, I guess, yes. There you are, just stick-ons on a background scene. Okay. That probably cost my parents a hefty penny when I was a child for some little uh, stick-on stickers. Nice marketing rose art. Very clever. I'll give you that. Okay. Ooh, nice little puzzle. This one's cool, too. Okay. 
That's what this is, right? Puzzle? Yeah, yeah. Okay, that makes sense. Why there's a puzzle piece in the corner? Oh, that's cool. I don't remember doing this puzzle either, but uh, it's very, it's very shiny looking. That looks neat. Might have to do that again. Comment if you'd like to see me do a video of making the puzzle or completing the puzzle. We can do that. We can make that happen with enough uh, likes, comments, and subscribes, certainly. A little dratini in the Pokeball here. I think that's mounted in there in some little way. We'll leave that open. Put it by the other Pokeball. Oh, uh, it doesn't want to stand up. That's good enough, though. Okay. Another empty Pokeball. I'm assuming one goes on display in there. Let's see, a little Bulbasaur. What is this thing? Oh, it's a pencil sharpener. Oh, Pokeball's rolling, rolling away. There we go. Stay. Oh, it's a little Bulbasaur pencil sharpener. It's neat. What is on the bottom? Some sort of little dino sticker that's unrelated. Okay. Neat. A little pencil sharpener. Ooh. These are styling. Some Pokemon glasses. Liking those. Another pair with little Pikachus on the side. Okay. Another. Oh, there's a lot of stuff in here, guys. We're going to make our way there. Another puzzle, ages four to eight. That would make sense why I don't remember any of it. This one looks pretty cool, too. I'm assuming it's all there. Oh, yeah, that looks... Actually, that's pretty much done. Well, that's going to be an easy video to do, guys, if you want to see that one. Okay, let's put that in the puzzle stack. Okay, let's just go here. A little Togepi thing. Let's go on this display stand. I would say, where's that from? From Pokemon 2000, the movie. This might have been like a little promo thing that you get when you went to a movie or something, I'm assuming. Um, I have another stand with a Mr. Mime, and it has, wait a minute. What's this little... Oh, his hands move! Check that out, guys! When you do the... Oh, that's kind of creepy looking. The little hands move when you press the bottom. So does that mean that he snaps and... Oh, maybe not. Wait, does he? I don't know how that works 100%. We're just going to set that here, though. Okay, so... Uh, bah, 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 bah. More little figurines, whatever this is. Oh, a ditto, okay, okay, that was throwing me off. I think these light up. I think these are little lights in the bottom of some sort, I would say. We're gonna put that in the figurine pile, though. Or a little, whatever you wanna call it, pile. Bulbasaur, does this do anything when I... No, it doesn't really do anything, okay. Oh, that looked like the wild in the grass one, though. Okay, let's see. Keep going. Some little keychains with some Kecleons on them. I very much like that. Ooh, Wendy's Kids Meal toys. Mewtwo there, Mewtwo there. I'm gonna toss that in that pile. Okay, let's see. Some more Kecleon toys. Um, what's on this one? Ooh, these are sealed. If anybody uh, wants to get the bidding going on these Wendy's Kids Meal toys, let's uh, let's kick it off in the comments. Okay. Let's see, another shiny Pokeball. Ooh, here we go, fellas and non-fellas. Golden little Pikachu bar. Very cool. I like that. I like that a lot. That's going to go front and center, I say. Now, a little vial plume pencil sharpener. You can tell by the feel. We'll put that in the pencil sharpener pile. Kind of surprised me to have one of those going. There was some words I never thought I'd say. Um, little Charmander. Put him here next to the other Charmander. What is this? Pokeball. That, like, rotates open. Oh, this must be, like, something where you, like, throw it or... I don't know. I'll put that in the... Pokeball pile. A little Charmeleon, he's chonky looking in there. I'll put it by the others. Got another one. Pikachu. Old school Pikachu. 
Put them right there. Uh, what are these? Got a sand slash halfway in a ball. Put it there. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba. Dragonite little figurine. I'm a big fan of Dragonite. We'll put him right there. Perfect. Okay. A master ball. I don't remember this at all, but we'll put it uh, right there. Maybe it'll stay. Ooh, this is cool. This is from a kid's meal too. Let's see. There's a little compass built in here. I don't know if it works. Oh, yeah, Wendy's kid's meal time. And there's a little clip on it so you can keep this on your uh, pants as well. That's nice. Big fan of uh, Pokemon Crystal, Silver, and Gold. Was a very good generation, second gen. Ooh, there's a nice fabric softener sheet. We'll toss that aside. Some more little figurines in here. Um, what is this? Okay. Oh, a little game with the little balls in the spring and you try and get a high score. Okay, that's cool. A little side duck on there. I like it. I like it. We'll put that there. Another Pokeball that seems empty. I'm going to put that in a little pile. Oh, this is adding up very quickly. Let's see. Oh, that is an odd looking mouth. Is that a candle or something? No, just an odd mouth. Yeah, probably a knockoff, I would say, in some way, shape, or form. Um, ba -ba -ba. Some more little figurines, some chancies, and a very, very off color Charmander. I don't know if that got colored at some point, maybe. I'll put it in the figurine pile. Oh, ho, ho, wow. Okay, so this is all marbles in here. It's a very nice uh, marble bag. Probably not going to take each marble out. We got a Meowth one. It's an Eevee bag. And this is all just cards in here of some sort. Oh, uh, look at that. Uh. Okay, sorry about that. There we go. Ooh, some holographic cards. Oh, a little book. A little fun facts. What is this from? A little short story? These must be a little short stories. There's some cards in here. Some other cards. Mewtwo Strikes Back. I don't know what all this is from, guys. Hmm. Let me know if I've just uh, stumbled onto a potential fortune. Okay, in the comments below. I would like to know that. Don't lowball me. A little Nido King figurine. Big fan of Nido King. We'll put it next to the Dragonite. Ooh, a Meowth Yo Yo. I think I remember this. And it lights up, too. There's little LEDs. I won't be trying to use this right now on camera. It's been a while since I yo-yoed, but that's very cool. I like that. Mm, little Jigglypuff pencil. Okay. Let's toss that there. Is the eraser soft? No, that eraser is hard. Oh, no, that's, that's, that's not too bad. That's kind of soft still. Okay. Ooh, little Groudon sticker pop out. I don't want to punch that out. We're gonna leave that how it is. Some more cards in here, let's see. Big old stack of cards with a hair tie. It's not mine, I'm bald and poor. Let's see, uh, yeah, there's probably something good in there, I'm sure. I'm just gonna set this card stack right there. Okay, border, I don't know if like around your room as a kid. Border stick up. There, we got 35 different stick-ups of Pokemon, three different ones. Oh yeah, check that out. That's cool. Okay, so, and there's more. Never put these in my room, but they were 99 cents at JCPenney's. Okay, what a deal. What is this? Another uh, little Wendy's Kids toy. Put that next to the other one. A little ring. Might just wear this around. Save it for a special occasion, you never know. Got 
some more cards. These little square ones. Some other cards here. I'm a little confused by the cards. I'm not sure what they're from. I don't think they're trading cards in any way. What's this here? A little keychain thing. Put in the keychain pile. Some more stickers. Nice and fresh in a baggie from 15, 20 years ago. Let's see. Some more of these little square card things. Beckett Pokemon and Anime Collector. I also had Yu-Gi-Oh stuff too, but Pokemon Ruby and Sapphire. Uh, Mega Man stuff. Oh, this is interesting. Oh, I don't know what this book does, but... All right, there's a couple more magazines in here. Ba, ba, ba. We'll just lay those there. Pokemon, Yu-Gi-Oh stuff. What is this? Some posters, I would say. Oh, that's cute. That's very cute. A little Pikachu on a scooter. Nice little birthday party thing. A Ritz ad. That must have been from something I cut out. Um, once again, we have some more magazines and little cutouts. Let's see, we have another cutout. A Pikachu cutout um, from something cardboard. That's very good. We're just gonna leave that in there. Some more cards, Tyranitar. Ooh, check that out. Whatever this is, these, uh, don't, I think these are like shrinky dinks or something like that. If anybody remembers or knows what this is, let me know. Set that there. Here's a little Bulbasaur ball bearing or ball maze of some sort. Set that there. Pokemon Handbook, the official one. The Lux Collector Edition. Oh, they go through every Pokemon and their stats, the original, at least. That's very cool. What else do we have? Ooh, hoo, hoo, the Advanced Handbook of Gen 3. That is neat. I remember this one. What else? Ooh, the Wendy's Kids Meal Bags. Check that out, guys. And I have multiple bags. Start the bidding in the comments below. And a Pokemon oh, Valentine. You can still use it, but I'm not going to. And then just random little things as well. Yeah, I'll set that out. All right, that is it, everyone. Here is my... Well, last little bit of Pokemon collection from when I was a kid. It's not much, but it's something. I'm glad to have it still. Um, if you guys have any sort of collectibles, things like that, honestly, if they if they kind of bring you joy or happiness or any sort of nostalgia, I would I would encourage you to try and keep them. I regret getting rid of a lot of my stuff. I used to have a lot, lot more, a lot of cards, a lot of really cool cards, collectible cards. All the different movies, VHS tapes, DVDs, and I deeply regret getting rid of all of them. But uh, I'm glad that there is this little bit remaining of my former collection. And uh, I think my favorite thing is probably the little golden Pikachu there. If you like this video, please, sure to, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, stay tuned for more. And kind of let me know in the comments down below what was your favorite thing that you kind of saw in my old collection. Let me know that what maybe you had or still have that is your favorite thing i kind of like the uh walkie talkies as well but uh all right guys have a good one